Hello? Mr. Barak, it's a pleasure and an Um, honor to speak with you, sir. Thank you so much for taking the time to take my call. We have a very interesting transaction, and the Saudi government has met with us um, about seven weeks ago here in Dubai, and they came to see some technical presentations regarding some um, cyber intelligence and interception solutions. And I have gained the trust of, let's call it, number two and number three after the king, obviously the MOD and his brother. And they're very much interested in a technology that we have. And let's just say they've, I've gained their trust very, very quickly because they've seen the way I do business. I deal with trust, integrity, yeah. and honesty with, with my clients. So I gained the trust of their attorneys. And their attorneys are actually of Jewish origin. Who is of Jewish origin? The lawyer for the Minister of Defense of Saudi. He has sent a formal um, official invitation that he wants to come to Israel uh, to see the actual systems running because he's going to be the eyes and ears. Whom, whom are you working for? I'm working with everyone there, but I work for my wife. <laughs> <laughs> so... I'm in a very but unique situation. The entity that serves, your personal service, is a Jewish, is an Israeli entity or Abu Dhabi entity or London entity or Singapore, whatever. We have actually what three, sir. Of? And now we're in the process of registering yeah. one here in the UAE. Uh-huh. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. And how, how did you come to identify what the Israeli partner for this deal? I got some advice yeah. from a lot of the people that I work with that are close with me there, um, mm-hmm. recommendations by close friends. I know that the technology has been installed in many different countries, which we can't talk about here because we're on that network. It seems like it's a full solution because we have to understand, Mr. Barak, there's, there's a certain structure that I can't go into the details with here because you realize where I am for the privacy of, yeah. of the people. that some Because yeah, we, know, yeah, we, yeah. Know, we know some of the same people, let's put it that way. And I'll be more than happy to sit and explain that to you in detail. But the structure of the transaction is very unique. And I have to explain that to you with four eyes because in order for it to succeed, uh, His Highness wants it done a certain way. And I'm I'm sure you know where this is going. There's always a financial benefit for people in transactions of this size. So people, you know, you understand where this is going. Yeah, Yeah, I understand. I'll tell you why I'm reaching out to you. You know, first of all, um, we have some mutual friends, which I'll explain when I see you in person, who think the world of you. And your name, I mean, just the image of Mr. Aoud Barak is, is just shakes the room, number one. Number two, you're Mr. Security. You're a int- very extremely intelligent person. Your CV is immaculate. You're a former prime minister. The biggest thing when, when I was speaking to this attorney, he's like, listen, I know who you are, but I need to see who you are in Israel. When I come, I want to sit with high-profile people so we can send a message to MBS and say, listen, we found your man. This is your channel. Mr. Barak, very much a pleasure, sir. It's an honor to speak to you. Bye-bye.